Aquarius Sun Moon Rising Venus and Jupiter hi guys welcome and you're watching the secret Sun Tarot let's see what messages you need to hear Aquarius of course reverse the roles if needed switch the cases don't force the reading on your situation April 2022 let's see what you need to hear April 2022 oh, real? okay ace of Pentacles <laughs> amazing new opportunity taking things forward i see you spying being little guarded reading more getting more information before you clearly decide that i want this right magician just before just after ace of swords right oh my god there's so much confusion surrounding this new start i see on off should i run away should i do it you know all right let's dive in let's dive in what comes to you let's see aquarius so let's see april 2022 what is this new month bringing for you oh participation four of wands relationship possibly or simply working things out with like-minded people sometimes it's not even like-minded it's just that you have to come together with people right for some of your nine of swords i see you are dealing with some kind of sorrow in your personal thing personal situation here but you want this to work out i see people coming together happiness celebration what is freaking you out then postponement or okay there's a guilt surrounding some balance and compromise that you're making in your life yeah I, I see you conflicted about something there's something that is stressing you out as you proceed forward towards the stability if this is a relationship you're already in i see you stressed out about something happening in it okay let's see what's happening here this is interesting a good card with a bad card let's see how things move forward there's definitely some unhappiness associated here aquarius i want to know what's that right let me know in the comment section what is freaking you out about this new fantastic relationship connection or something passionate coming towards you there's some kind of stress associated right so we have eight of swords three of wands and the fool yeah i see this um you're on the verge of making a decision taking the leap of faith jumping into something welcoming something in your life right or simply it's just letting everything on the universe and taking a dive but before that happens i see you are you're so freaked out about something this is this is something that is puzzling you aquarius i see that there is eventually a decision being made in the situation you're taking the leap of faith and you're like okay hell yeah i'll see what comes to me next i'm just ready right but this is happening after a phase of delay postponement i see your own thoughts are blocking you we're going to clarify what is the situation why are you experiencing i'm sorry experiencing this blockage right now you feel puzzled three of wands shows me that you're waiting for something right you're waiting for something so that you're completely ready to take this leap of faith or simply it's just that preparing yourself you know it's for some of you i see this is the fear <laughs> what will happen if i'll dive see this person is standing on the on the beach with a board thinking that okay i don't know whether i'll be able to jump in or you know go in or i'll just fail I'll, I'll just drown right there's a fear here before taking the leap of faith there's confusion your own thoughts and then there's a moment when universe is motivating you to just jump right jump and i'll follow jump and i'll catch wow i see there's something that is freaking you out let me know in the comment section what is this though eventually i see you taking over your fear and taking the leap of faith temperance here temperance shows me um some healing is happening here yeah moon i see you've been very very disappointed in past six of cups moon you have had some terrible experience that's what i'm getting a message here this can be with somebody who is a who's a fire sign maybe or this is your energy you wanted to explore your connection with somebody i see some yeah you tried manifesting something oh okay for some of you i see there was a love connection in your past 
that has really broken your heart right really broken your heart and i see it took some time to recover from that um, emotion you're coming out of it you're becoming the queen of wands magician but that past energy for some of you i see i heard for somebody that those past memories keep on reviving there's something that jitters you again and again i'm getting a vibe here aquarius that you know something is beautiful and universe is telling you to jump but there are some past insecurities that every time stop you there are fears you're scared of something okay 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 this is not right because on one hand i'm getting an amazing vibe that this is it and then on the other hand i'm feeling that what if this will fail what if i'll drown what if it won't work out my god i see that energy going hand in hand five of pentacles okay star hierophant oh and can you see that it starts bad and that it ends up beautifully it starts bad again and it ends up beautifully so i'm getting a vibe here again ta uh, tower is there one two three four major arcanas and this tower five no i'm sorry these are there are four major arcanas and we have the wheel of fortune the nine of cups you are in your own thoughts aquarius what is this let me know in the comment section I see this opportunity, there's a motivation, there's a feeling that we can make it happen. It's beautiful, it's amazing, it's stability. It's about stability. But then something just pulls you down back into this energy. Why? You take the leap of faith, you want to jump in, but those memories come back. For some of you, I see you're not opening a door. There's an opportunity banging your door, but you're not opening it because of what I don't know. What are you hoping for? Star, we're going to clarify. There's a hope. There's a, there's a feeling that something can happen, can go right. But this abandonment is something that uh, that I don't understand. I'm going to clarify what's this. For some of you, I see you're just in your own thoughts, Aquarius. You're just in your own thoughts and fears. Because something has happened in the past and that was bad, you feel that this is going to repeat. Five of Pentacles, Eight of Swords. This is going to repeat. Okay. I don't think so. I see you're overthinking about this because Hierophant again shows me that there's a pathway. Universe is opening a pathway for you. Now it's your decision whether you want to step up, go and rise above it, or you just want to stay sitting here, right? It's like, can you see this energy? I'm just getting a beautiful download here for somebody. You're hoping to have this light. You're hoping, you know that you're connected to this light this energy can be your higher self, can be somebody you you want, or can be something you want in your life. You know that there's a card attached. You're praying from the universe that you want this, you want this too. You want a path so that you can travel from here to this energy. And now universe is actually making that path for you, developing that path for you. The, from that light, the stairs have raised, right? I see that coming. But what you're doing here is just, just sitting, laughing and analyzing. You're happy that, you know, now I have the chance to move forward here, but you're still not doing anything. You need to get up, baby. You need to get up and start walking. Instead of sitting and being happy that, okay, universe has, you know, universe is listening to me and I'm finding the pathway. It's not sufficient. It's not sufficient. You have to get up and walk on that path to reach the light. Your final destination your final goal was not to get the path your final destination is to walk on the path and find your um final destination yeah you know to find that final thing that you were praying for and the tama moment is happening honestly i see that the tama moment is happening here you guys are super guarded you guys are super guarded before anything falls apart i'm getting a message this is a good sign along with the bad sign so this is good news with a warning you know they're coming together universe is giving you the pathway and if you fail to path if you fail to walk on that path i see the tower moment will take place and that path may fall might fall down right so you have to just for some of you i'm just getting this message that you're just in your head you're just in your head thinking and thinking and over and over again you know you have to take the leap of faith but you're not doing that what's happening in the near future let's see aquarius okay we have the queen of swords the empress and the queen of cups seven of wands here 
so much feminine energy again major arcanas for some of you i'm getting this message that you not willing to move forward again all these cards i see people sitting <laughs> aquarius sitting sitting see for some of you my god i'm just getting this download i don't know how many of you are actually going to understand that you're sitting here upset putting your face down thinking that mm, i never get what i want you know all negative thought universe never gives me that i ask for right and then you look up in the hope that universe will you will you just give me this the money i want the job i want maybe the relationship i want the partner i want the person i'm looking for and now universe is creating that pathway for you to just get up and find them get up and move to that light and you're just sitting and doing nothing right for some of you, this is your own energy, sitting and feeling that, ah, just, you know, not doing anything, sitting and putting your own logic into it, thinking that, what if this goes wrong? What if I'm doing the wrong thing? What if I'm taking the wrong step? Or what if I'm just, uh, you know, what if this decision is not right? What if I need more clarity? You know, what if I'm not prepared? You're just thinking and pondering and you are building negative thoughts here, right? For some of you, I'm getting another message that this process where you are just not leveling up and you're not doing something that you need to. Again, a lot of you might not like it because, of course, you want to know what's happening outside through tarot. But a lot of people, they just don't want to agree or they just don't, don't want to accept that some changes have to come from within. There is free will that acts. There is... Um, you know universe is going to support you only if you're ready to be supported right so i know a lot of you might not like it but for some of you this is the energy where somebody is coming in strong now if this is not you this can be your energy if this is not you then somebody is coming in to push you forward right and empress is the energy where you deserve this growth Aquarius, you deserve to come in this energy. And if you keep on dragging it, if you keep on pushing it away, you might end up losing a massive chance here, right? It's like C7 of Wands, resisting something, blocking something. Knight of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Sun, Eight of Wands. Oh my God, Knight of Cups. You are getting such amazing energy here, Aquarius. And I, I just don't understand why you guys are not leveling up to grab it. Right? I see eventually Queen of Cups. Someone is turning very emotional and this person wants you to move, right? And if this is not your energy, I see mother energy for some of you. You know there's growth potential. There's a massive growth potential here. Someone is trying to connect to you telepathically or you're trying to do it with somebody. I see your calls are answered or your 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 prayers are being answered here. Okay? Why are you so fucked up here? Six of Wands. Alright. Now, this is not something I was expecting. For some of you, I see your self-respect, your ego. You're feeling that a lot of people are looking at me, the attention. What is going to happen if I, if I try it out? What is going to happen? Magician, okay. I see there's somebody who really wants to manifest and take things forward with you, but you are sitting in your own emotions here. My God, the opportunity is here, the love is here, the confession is coming in, and you're just shutting the door over you, a uh, door over that. What is this intuition? Again, for some of you, I just feel you're just not letting go of the past, Aquarius. You're just not letting go of the past. Something has happened, I see either you're not recovered or you just don't want to recover. You know, it's just a feeling that I don't want to change. Now the transformation is banging your door. For some of you Aquarius, I'm getting this message that the change has to happen. Universe is going to force the change. If you are not going to move, universe will move you, right? Death shows me the massive transformation. Nine of Swords again, you're sitting overthinking and you know, just in your thoughts. But death shows me that the transformation is going to happen that is coming from the universe, right? Again, it's going to be in your hands if you want to or not. Strength, Eight of Cups, Five of Pentacles. Again, you're parting ways. You're not leveling up your Five of Pentacles. Again, for a lot of you, I'm just getting this message that you feel abandoned. You, you want more support. But if you want somebody to 
support you i see that i you know again i'm just getting this vibe that sometimes things are in your in your own hands the ball is in your own court and uh, you cannot every time sit and wait for support you need to level up here ten of pentacles knight of swords oh yeah and you know what if you do that i guarantee you something massive and beautiful is going to be coming towards you ten of pentacles sun knight of swords star tower yeah i see some jerk is going to happen now because you guys i, I see that there's some kind of stagnance in your energies and in this month you might feel that okay i'm praying universe give me this but you're not actually getting up and picking it up when universe throws it at you so universe is going to have its own ways to make it happen right and uh <coughs> I feel that universe is going to force it. If you are not going to do that, then universe is going to force it. But eventually, I don't know whether you will actually get that vibe and zeal to do it or universe is just going to flow, flow you along. But I see happiness coming in. So, okay, what else? Opportunity. Again, from the beginning of the reading, I'm getting this, that you guys are having an opportunity within the next few months the situation can drastically improve you need to be assertive you know wow okay let go again let go of something that you're holding on to aquarius what are you holding on to what do you need to hear here prosperity lies ahead again i'm just getting this vibe you know in this energy i feel so stuck so stagnant i feel like just coming to your place and pushing you <laughs> it happens you know i see it's just that you are not in the frame of mind to really see something you're just blindfolded here but i see it's a big opportunity right look at the bigger picture aquarius you guys it's time to take action see all the cards in all the decks they're just showing me that you have had some healing time period i do see that you're recovering from some things but there's a big opportunity banging your door and if you let it go uh universe will force it somehow you know universe is going to force it somehow i just feel it the magician may okay magic is alive in your life what you need to be successful will manifest if you believe you can do it again can you see the concurrence if you believe you will manifest it if you get up you're going to have it right it's just that that you know that something is missing here you have to go and grab it sensitive open-hearted inexperienced and moody you might be experiencing somebody like that messages regarding relationship new emotional experiences a romantic encounter social invitation or events heightened psychic abilities so again i see this is something very naive being offered to you and if this is love i see you were just sitting and feeling that i want love i want love i want love and when the when universe is giving you the opportunity to grab it you're just you know sitting and feeling and just overthinking and i'm just getting that vibe here okay main male so if you are a female i see somebody entering the scenes with whom you can have a very long-term prospect false person okay for some of you i see um you might be dealing with somebody who is hiding something from you but there are thoughts there are thoughts right okay this person is definitely hiding something for you imprisonment you in your own thoughts courtship okay so there's a partnership coming your way it's in the initial stages i don't really see that right now right now it has reached the real potential but in the near future it can again if you believe and if you are ready to do that right i see you in your own thoughts which you have to come out of right all these cards are showing me that you need to let go of some emotions and be assertive in the situation right so that's what i have for you Aquarius. thank you so much guys for watching bye